What's going on people, Sam here. Chain installation video today, specifically a Shimano 11 speed chain, um, but this video should help you with installing any chain on your bike. Here we go. <laughs> the Shimano chains come with these, which are their little quick links, which look like this. And on the SRAM chains, you'll find what's called a power lock. And you can buy these as replacements if you need to. <laughs> Once you've got your big old greasy chain out of the bag, you need to start feeding it in. And before you start feeding it into the cassette and the derailleur, make sure that you're in the lowest gear. I'm going to do that again so that you're not looking at me, you're looking at what I'm doing. <laughs> it's a big derailleur. <laughs> oh, wait. So before you start feeding it into the derailleur, make sure you're in the lowest gear. There. That's using this device up here. <laughs> <laughs> and it does help if you clean the bike first because then you don't get quite as mucky. feed this up and over this little bit of metal in there. I don't know what it's called, I'm sure it's got a fancy name. <laughs> hey, there we go. Right, then we move on to the quick link. Just explain that to me again. This is a quick link, yeah. Shimano make a quick link. SRAM's version of a quick link is called a power lock. You got that? I'm just waiting for it to open. <laughs> <laughs> Shimano recommend that you face the chain with the little bits of writing facing out rather than in towards the bike. As to why they do that, I'm not sure. But I'm sure there's a good reason for it. So we're now going to fit the quick link. And what the quick link does is you've got two bits that are exactly the same and they fit into each other like that and then pull tight so that they're secure. So once you've got the chain on and you've got the quick link in position, it's not actually locked yet, but what we're going to do is drop the bike down onto the floor and then put some weight through the pedals so that the chain goes nice and tight. And then hopefully what you'll see is the quick link locking. So that's just here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put the brakes on so the bike doesn't go anywhere, put a bit of weight on the pedals and hopefully that will do the trick. Ready? Yeah. Once you're happy that the lock's in place, just make sure that those links are moving freely. Give the chain a little run around. Looks pretty good to me. There we go. So short and sweet one, that is the Shimano 11 speed installation. Like, comment and subscribe as always. And we'll see you in the next one.